In this tip, I'm going to show you how to create an enclosed dot plot. An enclosed dot plot is the same thing as a barbell chart, except the line goes behind the dots and encloses them. Let's say, for example, we want to look at sales by subcategory. We're going to change the mark type to a circle. And if we want to compare two years, let's say 2020 and 2021, I'm going to filter the, down to those two years, add the order date field to the color shelf, so now we can see our two years. I'm going to then duplicate the sales field on the columns. On the marks card, I'm going to change the second sum of sales to be a line and move the year field from the color shelf to the path shelf. From here, I'm going to make this a dual axis chart. I'm going to right click on the axis and choose synchronize. And then the axis that has the line, which is the top axis, I'm going to right click on that and move the marks to the back. So this is a barbell chart. But to make it an enclosed, uh, an enclosed dot plot, we're going to go to the line on the marks card, go to the size shelf, and we're just going to increase the size until it surrounds the circles. So you just kind of play around with it until you get the size that you like. From here, I go ahead and change the color of that to maybe be a lighter color, even slightly darker gray. And there, from there, it's just formatting to get it to look the way you like. Now, this doesn't have to be done with dates. We could also do it with, let's say, regions. So if we create a new sheet, let's again do subcategory sales, change the mark type to a circle. And instead of years, we're going to use regions on the color. So now we have four of them. Let's duplicate the sales field on the second sales field on the marks card, change it to a line, and move the region field to the path shelf. We can then make it a dual axis, synchronize, move the line to the back. And then again, we just go to the line on the marks card and we make it bigger. And there you go. So you, it doesn't necessarily have to be a date. And you can see we've got more than one dot inside of this one. Hope you found that useful. Have a good day.